Hey up everyone, I'm just down at the bottom of the farm and I've just remembered we probably haven't said hello to the llamas for a while. I think they're sort of going under the radar a little bit because they are down here just sort of living the best lives of their own accord and we've not been, uh, we haven't been doing all that much with them. But I thought we'd head in and see how they're going on and uh, just check up on our two careers that were born um, born at late summer time, see how they're doing. Tell you what, they look to be doing pretty well from here, but we'll go see what they're up to. Now then, it is a bit wet and windy today, and it's uh, it's the perfect weather for them to take advantage of the shed at the back. So at the minute, they're getting fed in there, uh, they're getting watered just out here. But they do spend uh, a fair bit of time underneath, um, staying dry and out of the rain. Now thankfully, we've had not too bad a weather, it hasn't been completely soaking wet, and it hasn't been too freezing cold most of the time, so we've been pretty lucky, uh, and we've been keeping them out here in the shed. Now this little one knows no different, because he has been born outside. Out in the field, I found him, uh, and he's, he's used to the outdoor weather. Both of these two creas are doing amazingly well, aren't you? Really, really robust little creas, which is what we asked for. One of the things with alpacas and llamas that you need to keep an eye on is, uh, is the weight of them, because they've got these sort of fluffy coats, and because they're quite tall and long animals, it can be quite deceiving to how much weight they're carrying. So it's quite good to often uh, grab one of these, have a little feel of its back, and make sure it's carrying enough weight, which these two most definitely are. Now, um, you know, they've spent a lot of their time outdoors. Uh, they're doing really, really well from it. We think uh, they're probably robust due to it, and we're really, really happy with the progress they've made. So just a quick drop in with them, see how they're doing, and I'm happy to say that they're doing fabulously. So yeah, there's that little update for you. Um, like I said, I just want to keep you updated on how they're doing because they are spending a bit of time out here outdoors and I think it's, it's easy to forget they're here. So if you come to the farm, make sure you come down to the sand paddocks to say hello. These llamas are doing great. Um, I dare say they're doing better outside with this. They've obviously got this sheltered area than they would if they were inside. They seem to really enjoy it. Um, so thanks again and we'll see you later. I'll see you. Bye.